In this post, uh, we are going to talk about a very interesting topic of what are the benefits of having a third party in a twin flame relationship. Let's start with this question that uh, do twin flames have other partners or can your twin flame be married to someone else or can your twin flame get married after you have met in this 3D world? The short answer to all the above questions is yes. Twin flames can have other partners, but that does not mean that it is the end of the world. In fact, it's quite common for one or both twin flames to be in other relationships before they meet. However, when twin flames do finally come together, they often find that their previous relationships are just pale in comparison to the connection they have with each other. On one side, it is also possible for one twin flame to be married to someone else when they meet their twin flame. and Another possibility is that your twin flame can get married to someone else after they had met you. This can create many complications and be quite painful for all involved parties. A detailed video on married twin flames can be found in the cards above. The third party in twin flame relationship refers to someone outside of the twin flame connection who is romantically involved with one or both of the twin flames. This could be a current partner, an ex or someone who comes into the picture. There are a few reasons why third parties often play a role in twin flame journey. For one, twin flame often meet before they are ready to fully commit to each other. They may need to work through their own issues or go through certain life experiences before they are able to come together in a healthy way. Another reason is that twin flames often have a strong pull towards each other. But this can also create a lot of fear and resistance. Third parties can sometimes act as a buffer or a distraction giving the twin flames more time to work through their own issues before fully coming together. While having a third party in a twin flame relationship can be a painful and frustrating, there are some potential advantages also. First advantage is that the presence of a third party means you have no other choice but to do inner work. Although inner work may seem difficult at present, but when you start doing it, then you realize how life becomes so easy and magical by actually doing it. Many of our students doing inner work have realized that the connection they share now with the twin flame is much better than the connection that they shared with the twin flame before they started doing inner work. Next advantage is that it can give you more time to work on yourself and your own issues before fully committing to your twin flame. As there are lots of triggers that are going to happen between you and your twin flame, so many times you will be asking this question that whether he is your true twin flame or not. You will run away from them or they will run away from you due to triggers. In those moments, having a third party helps in providing a feeling of security. Another advantage is the presence of a third party helps you to better appreciate the connection you have with your twin flame when you both finally come together. As the intensity of the connection between you and your partner is nothing compared to the intensity of your connection with your twin flame. So your current relationship act as a reference point for your relationship with your twin flame. Let's take the example of a real twin flame, Tinku, and how third party helped him in his union with twin flame. In our previous videos, we explained that Tinku got separated from his twin flame as both Tinku and his twin flame were already having partners, which means there were third parties involved between them. Tinku learned inner work and finally reached a state where the third parties were no longer having any problems regarding Tinku meeting his twin flame. Tinku had already gone through intense healing for a couple of years where he healed so many of hurts and upsets and triggers. Now Tinku started teaching inner work to his twin flame and so she started her journey of healing. The first step in healing yourself is that someone should trigger you. In the twin flame mirror video, we explained that these triggers can come from anyone which means you can be triggered by your spouse, family members, friends and last but not the least from your twin flame. And we also explained that the triggers that come from your twin flame are the worst. In the case of twin flame of Tinku, most of the triggers were coming from the third party which means the triggers were coming from the partner of Tinku's twin flame. And Tinku acted as a healer who was able to help her to heal. This way the importance of Tinku increased in the eyes of his twin flame as he was acting as a savior, a guide, a teacher, a way shower or we can say a person whom one can surrender to as that person knows more than you about the mechanics of inner work. So what happened when this third party left? With lots of triggers and lots of healing, this third party left the life of Tinku's twin flame. But the healing was not complete. So now both 
triggers and healings are happening through Tinku, which means first Tinku triggers his twin flame and then he helps her to heal. Sometimes when a trigger happens, it becomes difficult for both of them to stay in touch with each other because the pain caused by the trigger is too much. Then both of them have to take a break from each other and then they try to heal it individually. It becomes an ironic situation that you are running away from the only person who can actually help you in healing the hurt that you are feeling. When there was a third party, the healing was faster as the triggers were smaller and Tiku was able to guide his twin flame in healing. After the third party left, the triggers became more intense as they were now caused by Tinku himself and he has to play both roles of first triggering a hurt and then helping to heal. So it sometimes become too much for both of them. But with the help of a third energy which is the divine grace, they are able to manage this beautiful relationship. We will talk more about this energy in some future videos. So in conclusion, the twin flame journey is a complex and often challenging one. We are not saying that twin flames should have third parties in between. We are not promoting it. We are only saying that third parties can play an important role in this journey, but they do not have to be a permanent obstacle. If there is a third party, then understand that they are for the highest good of both of you. With inner work, twin flames can work through these challenges and come together in a beautiful and transformative way. So if you are on a twin flame journey, remember to trust the process, do your inner work and have faith that everything will work out as it is meant to be. If you have any questions or comments, then please leave them in the comment section of this video. You can join our telegram channel to avail notifications about free meditation sessions and upcoming programs. The link of telegram channel and link of our inner work programs can be found in the description of this video. To watch upcoming videos, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching and we see you next time.